This is Ted with Creation TV. I'm here with Wayne Pygram. So, how is the convention for you so far? Look, it's been great. Um, to think that the numbers have sprung up again from last year is uh, just fabulous. Meeting lots of new fans, lots of people who uh, have only just discovered the show. So, uh, the old Farscape still has legs. Uh, definitely. Mm. So, it's not going to be the, the farewell as we thought it was going to be? Well, Apparently not. I mean, it's all news to me arriving this weekend and seeing that you know, another show is advertised, which is um, just fantastic. Um, I mean, the response this weekend has been great. Last night was great, playing uh, some rockabilly with uh, some fans. Um, James, Scotty and Michael, that was quite fabulous, a really lovely thing to do. Uh, but, I mean, this is a special weekend. Uh, we owe a lot of credit to Creation and Mr Browder himself, who does make this weekend a special weekend for the Farscape fans. Well, thank you for joining us. It's, it's My fantastic having you here. So uh, we hear that uh, there's another big event in your life. I am a dad for the first time at age 48, so there's life in this old geezer yet. <laughs> no, fabulous thing, Ted. Um, obviously very planned. Um, my girlfriend Tracy, she's not as old as me, but we decided last Christmas to, you know, come on, lovey, uh, we're, you know, the, the clock is ticking. And uh, we were successful, very successful, within really the second attempt, i got to say. Um, but Tracy has since told me that if you punch our, our ages into the computer and do the stats, in any given month, it's 3%. So we were very, very lucky. Wow, well, congratulations. Uh, thank you very much. Yeah, that's fantastic. Yeah. Um, I wanted to ask you, playing such a, di such a unique character as Scorpius, um, is there a challenge, another role that you'd like to to play? Something that is there something else that can challenge you more? You think anything without a makeup? Without a makeup. Look, I love doing the makeup, and he's very, very special to me. Um, but unfortunately, there is a sting in the tail of guys doing makeup. It hasn't necessarily helped me uh, career-wise. Um, it's being flippant to say anything without a makeup, and also I would always get back in the makeup. I'd always do him again, um, but there's nothing particular uh, that I could say that you know I, I need to do in my working life. But it is it is very important for me in my working life for what it, whatever comes next that's big, is me outside of a makeup. Understandable, mm. absolutely. Well, thank you very much for for even though with us. they do say I have a good head for radio. Nice. Mm. Thank you very much.